Hey, good morning, guys. Uh, just a quick message. Um, nothing special, but just dealing with First John one nine. You know, when you mess up, Jesus forgive me, or God forgive me, Father forgive me. There's nothing wrong with that. The thing is, you're already forgiven. Um, you, if you never noticed though that you repeat those sins over and over, you keep doing them over and over again. Don't make God get out the switch on your butt. It's called repentance. You're forgiven once and for all. You don't have to confess to be forgiven of sins. The Lord wants you to repent of your sins now that you're saved. You don't lose salvation. You're a child now. And the, uh, the one that the Lord receiveth, he scour scourges every child that he receives. That means you get your butt whooped. And, and, and I don't care what teacher you've heard that they try to water that down. You will, if the Lord receives you, you know, and he does, anybody that will, let him come drink freely from the water of life. But if you, if once you believe on the Lord Jesus Christ, to think for one minute, you're just going to, oh, I'm saved. Oh, la di da da da. I can just run wild. Oh, no <laughs> you're in for a big awakening by the way you know what your sins are and what things uh, that God puts his finger on if he puts his finger on it you can't make excuses for it you can't even justify it you can't even try to make it well I'm saved by grace and all that yeah that don't work <laughs> I'm sorry yes you are saved by grace I mean that's a gift that's eternal and it don't change but homie don't play that meaning God don't play that you're going to get your butt scorched if you keep on going the way you're going whatever it is if you're doing wrong he loves you too much to leave you where you're at he wants you to grow in Christ he wants you to excel as his kids after all you are priest, you're a holy priesthood we got something to uphold we have a uh we have a, um, a standard. And you know what? He ain't going to let you just make a mockery of it. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to step on no toes, but if you're his, guess what? Your butt's going to get whooped if you're, <laughs> if you're out of fellowship. You're not ever out of fellowship, actually, but you can, you can be like the prodigal son. It's called repenting. God wants repentance. You're forgiven once and for all. It's abolished at the cross, your sins. But I tell you what, try to go do what you want to do. See how, tell me how that's working out for you. <laughs> tell me how that's working out for you. He's going to scorch your butt, man. If you're his, he's going to scorch that ass. I'm sorry. I am not mean to be blunt, but some of y'all might need to hear it like that. Might not have heard it like that. But the truth is, the Lord loves you too much, and you're a representative of the kingdom of God. So he's not going to leave you just, just doing whatever you want. I'm sorry, you're stuck. Once you believe on Christ, you're stuck. Your life will be miserable. It will be miserable if you reject, reject to grow, man. Um, it's a beautiful life, though, what Jesus did for us. It's wonderful. To grow in Christ don't give up don't give up it don't mean that you don't mess up just don't just don't give up throwing the towel that's what it means to faint not you might have a couple bad days but get off your you know what and get back in line get back in line the Lord's waiting for you he's he's not forgot you and you know he's there with you whether you knew it or not but get back in line and grow and, and continue on. Continue on, soldier. In Jesus' name. Hey, man, it's sometimes three steps forward, four steps back. But then it might be another step forward. You know what I mean? But you can't give up. Where are you going to go? Where are you going to go? You know the truth now. Where are you going to go? Now that you know the truth. 
there's no there's no escape but life is beautiful in Christ man that, that's the only way to go we got to do it we got to hang in there brush off brush off brush your shoes off brush your armor off get your armor on meaning the Word of God put it back in your mind realize who you are in Christ and don't give up he ain't giving up on you and you always be you're eternally sound and saved if you trust on Christ but you're gonna be one miserable you know what if you just run he wants you to run to him not run away don't run away that ain't gonna do you no good friend it's gonna take time to grow but it's worth it it's worth it so run to him not away God bless you guys he's always with you though even if you make your bed in hell you know he ain't gonna forsake you but it just ain't no fun there right ain't no fun there all right God bless you